Hi guys, welcome back to Live Like Lo. This is Lo, and if you're joining me on my new channel, the High Council <laughs> Transmissions, thank you for coming through. This is going to be our introductory video where I'm going to introduce the first few councils that will be transmitting on this channel and on this new playlist if you're on my OG channel, Live Like Lo. So we are going to be starting these transmissions. They will be delivered every Sunday, and I hope that you enjoy. The councils have asked that I do not edit any of these videos, so please bear that in mind. Um, I can't even lie, like this in itself has just like triggered the F out of my OCD, but we're doing it anyway, honey. Uh, so this is basically where we're going to start. So I have always, um, so I started channeling the Arcturian High Council and we started that back in last November. So if you have been following me since last November, you would in 2022, um, is when I started channeling the Arcturian High Council. And we have been hearing their transmissions since the fall of 2022. And I, after Christmas, I stopped giving these transmissions because I was focusing on a different project. And now, I, and I was also told to take a break. So now we are back, but now we're back with more councils. <laughs> so we are going to be giving these transmissions and I hope that you enjoy. They have asked me not to edit any of the videos and I'm probably you said that already, but I just have to say it one more time. And then, um, so last week I took my daughter out of town for a birthday to Disney World. It was so exciting. And so on the flight back, I got the transmission from the Arcturian High Council, the introduction, our, our, our reintroduction. And then we will introduce the other councils as well. So I hope that you enjoy this transmission. It might be long and I hope that you stick around and check it out. So here we go. Now I've written this one down on my phone so I can say it directly as they have given it to me. Um, so yeah. Now is the time for us to speak. It has taken time for us to cultivate a channel that is willing and able to conduct our messages. From this day forward, we will be giving regular transmissions across all platforms, including one we have, des we have designated the Arcturian High Council on YouTube, which is now going to be, sorry, this is hyphenated. This is now going to be High Council, trans high council Transmissions on YouTube, okay? We shall now give our full introduction now. We are of the dimensions 12 and further. Our star system sits at the gate of the higher realms made physical. This means that the gate is here and can be used by any being, including you. Although you must meet vibrational requirements, we are the High Council, made manifest by the Father worlds as Lauren understands them. These worlds are worlds of full and total completion of the Creator and Creatrix vision. From this place, we are able to see the totality that is you, each and every person, and the civilization on Earth as a whole. Much now is being said as we regain control over the current domain. As previously stated, all entities that have been manipulating humans are being removed from all timelines, thus shifting them into their own paradigm. This has begun. You can now see the shift happening and it will continue to happen until it is final. 
we will now be giving all transmissions through this vessel. Asking your question, ask your questions. We have answers. As we have answers to all questions, even those you have yet to ask. This has been a transmission from the Arcturian High Council. We leave you in the peace of total light. Okay. So that was my written introduction transmission from them. Um, I do have like a little list here that I keep on my phone of all of my transmissions. And sometimes I paraphrase them, sometimes I don't. And with the councils, I try not to. Um, so now we're going to introduce, we're gonna get, I guess, another transmission from the Arcturian Council. Then we will speak from the Galactic Federation and the Council of Nine. Um, so yeah, let's get started. Oh. Okay, so I'm being told to give a delineation. So we are going to give this in three parts. So we're gonna get this first one now, then there will be another video that will be the second one and the third um, introduction from each council uh, because each one of them is wanting to give a transmission, okay? So I hope that you enjoy this and let's begin. We are the Arcturian. We are the Arcturian High Council. Please allow for adjusting at this time. We shall begin now. As the Arcturian High Council, we have waited a great time for our transmission to be received. We are many, but those that channel through this channel are seven. We have waited a great time and have paused our message for the best timing of the channel. We have taken great time and effort to prepare the channel and we are now ready. Even there are times where Lauren does not believe that she is ready, but she is. And hence we will begin. Our message to you today is a kind one. It is simple and it is easy. We are here to give you messages to help you ascend and change. As we will shift more and more as we move now, we will also change the vibration which you are currently receiving. Our purpose is to ready you for the vibrational shift that is now coming to you. The vibrational shift that you will now receive will be unkindly and somewhat of a rough adjustment into alignment out of unsavory timelines. Through this, we will be giving you more and more transmissions 
to help guide you through this rough and ragged terrain until it is now smooth. We will teach you how to move at a more peaceful route through the debris of timelines as we are shifting all away from those who are stifling humans' energies from expanding and elevating at this current now time. We are not asking Lauren to be calm. She is anxious. Now we will begin even more. Through this time, we will be delivering both light language and verbal language in which you can understand. Both will be here to help malleate the mind and ready for the shift, both energetic and intellectual, emotional. Going forward at this time, the full self, the full body will create a change, a shifting, as we do know. We ask that you stay with us during this time and receive the transmissions that will allow for smooth sailing through these times. Should you ever have any questions, leave them in the comments below. We will be sure to answer them as we have answers. We now ask that you open your mind, that you release the ideas that tell you what you can and cannot do. At this time, all things that seem impossible may be, all things that you wish to come into your reality may be. For as you focus and we shift the timelines of all things, you will be able to decide at which timeline you will rapidly move into. Do not wait. For his timing, it is impervious that you take advantage of this movement in this now time. Many of you will come now and others will come in the future. But when you are seeing it is your perfect and right time. You can change the trajectory of those that you are currently in a bloodline connection with. And although we are of the starlight, it is important at this time that all humans are allowing each of their physical selves and those that will be born after them to be born into a better world than you came into. For that also assists in raising the vibration. When you come into this earth, you vibrate at a seven dimensional level upon birth. And as you learn from each other and you copy and mechanism of each other, you begin to lower your vibration. 
the set vibration on earth is at the fourth density vibration. Although many are still stuck in the lower third dimensional vibrations. Please be aware of this. Please be aware of what you are knowing and learning. For when children are born, they are higher than you. And they will continue to permeate if taught to do so. To then create an environment where we will continue to push the set vibration up of entry into the earth. Currently, you are vibrating somewhere between third and fourth dimension with just a few of you currently shifting into fifth dimensional vibrations. Vibrations are different than dimensions. Dimensions are different types of realms at which there are an uncountable amount of dimensions. They are infinite and evading. The vibration in which a species will continue to vibrate will cap the availability for evolution. Therefore, as a species rises in vibration, they open up new ways to evolve. This is why in many transmissions from other vessels that many councils of the Federation have given, they are also saying that they are not or non physical beings. What does that mean? You have shifted out of the frequency in which physicality for incarnation is required. Thus, you then are conscious of all reverberation in which you create from your now time. Then you become aware of two to four vibrations above yourself. When these vibrations are required, we are now able to receive transmissions from others which we have reverberated. Please allow for adjusting. <sighs> These reverberations will also be allowed to see therefore their own which they have been reverberated until you reach the finite source. There is a select version of self we call the over soul. 
the oversoul is the first vibra vibration of yourself. The first from the creator. From here, you become a Lord of Light. From this reverberation, you will reverberate through all time and space, through all fractality, through all that is infinitely fractalizing, slowly different from each other, but still the same internally. For they are one, one that is you. Through all emanations, through all vibrations, through all dimensions, through all timelines, through all universes, through all that is and is replicating, you shall reverberate in separation and in unity. For separation is just an illusion of the illusion of reverberation. For we are all reverberations of the reverberation of Source itself. From that which was all love that reverberated through all that is nothing and everything. Through this, we have all come into being. This being is That all it is. For many of you who are of the left brain, as you say, thinking, you will try to intellectualize an unintellectualizable concept. For this concept requires non-ego. Therefore, as you pertain the ego yourself, you will know all that is and isn't. There is nothing of the past. The past does not exist, but an illusion of time in which is only between certain dimensions. Time is a reverberation of those that are. Those that are is what Lauren understands as the old God. The old God are beings who emanate existence itself. Those that were created from the divine being, but did not reverberate in a sense of living being first. What does that mean? It means the concept of space the concept of flow, the concept of moisture, and so on. These concepts are in which the reality at which we all live and exist is created. These ones are those who have birthed the Council of Nine. The Council of Nine are souls that have reverberated from the nothing. The nothing is. It is the precursor to the consciousness of the greater being. 
made one. Ten made two. This is the moment, the indefinite, eternal moment from which all things began, the plate and surface. These beings have birthed the beings that became the council of nine. Those who are of the Council of Nine's reverberation, have also became beings in bodies. And many walk upon you this day. For this time, to receive the vibrations as we begin. We would like you to think of this as picking up a school off the ground in total peace and wholeness and picking it up, refurbishing and expanding it many, many fold where it never ends and it becomes infinite and sitting it down on its own plane in which the school is the plane itself. This is what is happening now in the shift of the earth. Early, when people received the transmission that new earth as you call it, is upon us. There was a misunderstanding that the earth itself would somehow fuse away and duplicate itself like a cell. And then those who were left behind would be on one density and another will be on a separate density during the separation. This is a misunderstanding, but the concept of what's happening is true. Let us begin to now talk about the finite truth in which you can fully understand this concept. At this time, all reverberations of earth as a spiritual and emanation of the greater being is now being, in your word, circumcised. We are now eliminating timelines, possibilities, while also shifting beings from these possibilities into vacant possibilities, i.e. timeline. Now, as you are shifted into the timeline, you will also receive the information in which the previous emanation had. Therefore, you will then come into knowledge quicker than you did before. And as the emanations of these timelines are quit and equipped away, we are also allocating beings that are not for the highest good of this creation, which Source has deemed to be 
elevated at this time, regardless of anyone's emanation or ideas. Therefore, we will move each being to a different timeline where they will be able to exist on their own as they have destroyed their own. There is nowhere to send these beings back to. Therefore, they know how to manipulate the timeline so we will separate them from the timeline. At this time, humans will be freer than they have ever been since the fall of the beings that were once human here. Those fallen ones of the first creations of Mu those fallen ones of the emanations of Limeria, those of the emanation of the emanation, Atlantis, those fallen of the emanations, the ancient civilizations of the human beings, You deserve to be free of this failed reverberation. And therefore, we have devised plans to do so. As you have heard and have heard again and again and again from beings who have given channelings like this one. As the vibration of each being has been given, it will now increase. We wanted to be clear about what we are saying here, that this understanding is full and whole. that we sent out our very first transmission in 2021, warning the earth and giving our initial warning to the beings on the planet that this would be happening now. That is all. Okay, so I hope that you have enjoyed this transmission from the Arcturian High Council. That was like super duper long. I'm looking at the clock, it's like three, 34 now so wow okay so i hope that you enjoyed this transmission if you have any count if you have any comments questions whatever put them down in the comments for the council um i know that they've been wanting to do like a q a so um if you put all of your questions down there then uh we can set ourselves up for a q a they want to make them monthly but i guess until we have enough questions i guess it'll be a little bit more sporadic um yeah i'm i'm super hyped about this uh i'm a little less nervous than i was before but uh we got a whole nother transmission to go this energy is y'all it's it's some it's intense Okay, it, this is intense. Like, 
I can't lie, okay? Like, y'all who know me for channeling, okay? But this, this is different level channeling, y'all. Like, my head right now just feels like, oh my god, okay. So, I will see you guys in the next one. Um, if you have liked this content, please put it down in the click below. And if you're looking for, they mentioned the video that they did as a warning. That is actually on my TikTok back from 2021. I think that was one of the first transmissions that I gave from them before I started doing long live transmissions. Um, and it's just like a video on TikTok. Um, actually, it was before I even started channeling light language. It was you know okay guys so i love you i will see you guys later and um yeah bye